This is a quick video tutorial on selecting the right nozzle for a Rainbird 1800 series spray head. Right now the homeowner has got a 10 variable nozzle installed. What that means is it's a 10 foot nozzle. It's a variable, which means you can close it completely and not have any water coming out, or you could ultimately open it up to do a 360. And we know it's a 10 nozzle based on the color, the blue color on the top of the nozzle. But what we want is the homeowner is asking for a little bit more distance of throw. So what we're gonna do is unscrew this nozzle. And what we'll do is we'll come over here and we have a large selection of different nozzles to pick from. So we're gonna grab a 12 quarter nozzle. And what we'll ultimately do is screw that one on there. And then we'll adjust it so it's coming out. Now I have this, this particular head just propped up temporarily just for video purposes. But now we've got a 12 quarter nozzle. Now if we pan over here, we've got quite a few different nozzles that Rainbird has as options. We've got stuff as small as fours and sixes, all the way up to 15s and 18s. There's a wide selection of them. Typically what we do is try and stick with eights, tens, 12s and 15s. The 8s being green, the 10s being blue, the 12s being brown, and the 15s being black. Now we do our best to stay away from the variable nozzles and the reason being is they just have a smaller dirt tolerance and tend to clog up a little bit more often. But for the most part what we've got is a lot of variety here to work from. Mainly we stick with the 10s and the 12 nozzles, but when we get into the 15s, they make a lot of variety. Not only the quarters and the halves, but we've got variables, and then we've got some for long skinny areas, for smaller skinny areas, and then we've also got them that throw long distances to the right and to the left, and nothing out in front, nothing in behind. So we've got a wide variety of nozzles to pick from. Um, typically, if you were to buy a head from a hardware store, they're gonna give you the 15 variable nozzle. Now we encourage homeowners, whenever they're putting a new head in, we ask that you contact a contractor and get the appropriate nozzle for each particular location, not just the standard 15 variable. So for example, we'll go back to our head here. And in this case, we put on the 12 quarter nozzle. So what it's gonna do is throw 10 or 12 feet out and do a quarter uh, diameter. Hope this video helps. Thanks for watching.